a whole lot of inspired stuff. We're all fired up. And then what happens? We wake up tomorrow morning and we go, this is another day. And the motivation and the inspiration disappears. So what I've got is a couple of little tools. I want to ask you to start something right now. It's a blank piece of paper. It's not making notes. Okay, if you want to make copious notes and write them down, good for you. Because nobody reads it. The reality is research shows 99.9999% of the people who make notes never ever read them in their life ever again. The 0.001% that do, don't even, you know what I'm saying, don't absorb it. So I'm asking you to do something called an action list. Okay, so if we can take a piece of paper right now and just write on the top, action list. And keep it one side. Because what your action list is, is the stuff, the behaviors, the goodies that you're going to take away and you're actually going to use in your life. they are going to make a difference, okay? The first thing I want you to do on your action list, who commutes to work every day? This is not a trick question, okay? Unless you live at the office, you commute to work, right? Okay, so we all, and, and how long does it take? How long does it take to get to work? 15 minutes, okay? How many days a year? 22 days a month you're going to work? For the whole year, what is, how many hours is that? Just going to work. Not talking about going out on weekends or other stuff. 300 hours a year, right? You're riding to and from work. 300 hours is more than one semester at university. What are you using that time for? Because I'm, I'm hearing everybody in their mind. They're all standing there, you're all going, I don't have enough time to add extra education into my life. Guess what? You've got 300 hours in your car just driving to and from work. I know what you're doing. You listen, you listen to music, eh? <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and what's it doing for you? It's oh, baby. But it's doing nothing, okay? Imagine, okay? Your boss has a look at you and he goes, you've been listening to music every single day to and from work. I'm going to promote you. Or, you have a CD like this. This CD is packed with all the information that I'm going to share with you here today. So when you leave here, on this CD, you can stick it in your car, you can put it on an MP3 player, you can listen to it for those 300 hours while you're going to it from work. Not just this, but you can go and get, there is buckets, whatever information you're looking for in your life, there's an audio book being made. You can take that mobile university and you can invest it into growth. Because how do you become successful? You, you pursue it, eh? You pursue it. You attract success. You attract success by the person you become. Am I right? So if the more you invest into you, the more you invest into becoming, So as you become more, so you attract more. So today is not just about managing your time. Today is about growing you. Because if you grow, you attract more, don't you? You've got 500 hours. That's the average person spends, not commuting, but the average person spends 500 hours a year commuting around. Two semesters at university. Do you think if you took... Every single year of your life and you invested it into personal growth, you invested it into listening to something that's going to make you better. Do you think that's going to make you, make you better? Do you think you've got a greater chance of getting promoted, greater chance of attracting things that you really want in your life? Is there anybody here who wants to fail? Put up your hand. Who wants to fail? How many of you want to be failures? Guess no one. Because we all want to succeed. We all want meaning in our life. We all want fulfillment in our lives. Am I right? How do we get it? By sitting in front of the couch watching days of our lives. Am I right? <laughs> or by going to happy hour 
every Friday night to getting drunk out of our minds and barely getting out of bed on Saturday. That's how we grow, am I right? Or do we grow by investing into us, by using our time more valuably? Who in the room pushes the snooze button? I know who you are. <laughs> so, you, know, you know, the snooze, you know, you know when the alarm goes off in the morning and then you push it and it gives you another 10 minutes of sleep? Who's guilty? I mean, yeah. Okay. Let me tell you about that 10 minutes. What does it do for your day? But imagine, imagine if you don't push the snooze button, but next to your bed is a transformational, educational, informational book that's going to help you grow. You pick up that book and you read for those 10 minutes. Any idea of the pages you can read in 10 minutes? If you fast. Between, you're absolutely right. Between 5 and 10. If you, if you, if you like really slow, 5. But if you're pretty quick, you can read 10 pages. But let's be conservative and say 5 pages. Do you think reading 5 pages is going to change your life? How about if you read 5 pages every single day of the year? 1,825 pages. All you've done, not push the snooze button. Average educational transformational book, 200 pages. You do the maths. Nine books a year. All you, pardon? 200. 200 pages each. Nine books. And all you haven't, all you've done is not push the snooze button. Do you think that can change your life? So we have got enough time, am I right? So it's not a shortage of time we have. It's a shortage of commitment on how we use. Correct. So that's what we need to be unlocking today. Is I want to come into your life. I want to come into your unique set of circumstances. And I want you to take the information and use whatever's going to work for you. On your action list, can I ask you to write those two critical things down? You are not going to push the snooze button. And even if you don't push the snooze button, wake up 10 minutes early every day of your life, put a book next to your bed, and read for 10 minutes. That's all. Whenever you're commuting in your car, have some kind of educational transformational, developmental audio book that you can listen to. Because that's going to change your life. That's going to make you better.